Hello guys, welcome to Master Talks channel. Today we are talking about Marine Motorola VHF and UHF radio programming. First, we start with a VHF radio. This is a GP3282 model Motorola radio. You see the programming kit from Motorola. With this uh, kit, you can programming base station, walkie talkie, all many type of uh, Motorola radios. Just connect the cable with the radio and the power up. Just power on. You can see the light already on. Now we are opening the software from uh, the boot up. This is a Motorola software. CPS software for, from Motorola. You can see the version about CPS. You can see the detail. So the version is uh, six point one two. The software you can download from the Work Motorola website, the CPS software for uh, programming software. Now we open the project, connect to the, already connect the radio and we read from the device. Then you see the radio software opening, already read from the device. You can see now all the channel frequency and uh, conversion personality just double click on the any one of them then you expand the whole uh, channel list you can see down so there is a button yes, just click on that you can see the all the channel list what is the frequency we set before if you want to do any changes you can edit and uh, download direct download but before download you must save the program then only you can uh, download to the radio see the green color is blinking just now now radio is already program you can now again Let's see the connection, the COM port, serial port, COM port. This is the COM port connection. You can see through the device manager. This is now COM port 4. See, device is COM port 4. This is a uh, VHF, this is a uh, UHF radio, that's why only 16 channel you can see. This is a hand, hand walkie talkie only you can programming up to 60 channels. Now we are going to programming base station Jeep sub, uh, radius 338 model. You can connect to the cable to the radio side in the same way the port number 4 and then now we are giving the power. Now you are giving the power supply, 12 volt supply to the radio side. Then power up the radio. This is a VHF radio. Then connect to the computer side. Open the same software, Motorola CPS software. Before that, you just make sure the combo setting again. You can see the combo number. Open the software now. Now we go to read from device. Just double click on that. Read. It will automatic read the read from the radio side. 
which is still updating the parameters see the communication is bringing now they already upload the details from radio you see the channel list this is the VHF channel Now just open one channel. You can see all the channel list. See the table. Now you can edit what frequency you need to use. You can edit all the channel as per your uh, requirement. Now I am going to edit one of the channel. Now again, try to download. The software version is the same software. Six point one two version is. You see the when you write into the. Radio, it will continuously blink. Now is uh, program already download to the radio. See now this radio is in the programming mode. It's uh, showing it's a uh, test mode. It's a uh, programming mode. Then it will download the finish. It will automatically restart. See the now is a program downloaded already. The channel number ten. I am writing now master talks. You can see I am writing master talks, just editing the channel name. Then you need to save. I am going to save. Then downloading to the radio. Now it is downloading. You can see the programming cable is blinking continue blinking. And the radio go to test mode. Now it is downloading the program. So see, see the green light is continuously blinking. Now it's still downloading. Now restart the radio. Automatic restart. Now we go to set the channel number ten. See, the already changed the.